Thanks for joining me for this Met Office weather update this afternoon. Fairly grey, and for many of us, we'll see some wet weather as well. It will mostly be rain, but there is some snow still falling over northern Scotland. Here's the bigger picture from space, and you can see one, two swirls of cloud, two areas of low pressure that are dominating our weather. These weather fronts have been slowly pushing northwards, bringing wet weather, but also behind it introducing slightly milder air. But much of Scotland is still in the cold air, and so as the wet weather works in here, we are still seeing some snow over the higher ground of northern Scotland, where we have a Met Office yellow warning in place. With a gusty wind blowing here, that means blizzards possible, so that makes for some pretty tricky driving conditions, particularly on those higher routes. A little bit of snow is likely for a time at lower levels as well, but through the central belt and further south, it is all rain that we see. And it's not going to rain everywhere all day. There'll be some brighter spells through the Midlands, a hint of sunshine. And we've got the milder air in place across the south. Temperatures could get into the teens. It's a slightly warmer day over northern England and southern Scotland, but still feeling pretty cold here, and especially feeling cold across northern Scotland with that gusty wind. And so we'll continue to see some hill snow here through the nights. And again, could be icy in places also. Elsewhere, we'll see further outbreaks of rain for parts of Northern Ireland, Northern England, and Southern Scotland. We'll see some showery rain working away from Eastern England. So actually a good part of England and Wales becoming dry for a good part of the night. With clearing skies, could turn a little misty in places and temperatures will drop well down into single figures, but uh, most places will be above freezing as we start the weekend. Certainly feeling get very cold, though, still in northern Scotland with that strong and gusty wind only slowly easing. We'll also start to see the winds picking up in the southwest as we go into the weekends and showers expected here to develop pretty quickly over southwest England and south Wales. Further rain across central and southern Scotland, further snow on the hills of northern Scotland, but through the day becoming increasingly confined to the tops of the hills. Still pretty windy in the far north as well, but for a good chunk of the, the Midlands, North Wales, northern England, eastern England, and a large part of Northern Ireland. It'll be a dry and a bright day on Saturday. We'll see some winter sunshine coming through and that milder air will be continuing to trickle its way northwards as well. So temperatures for many should be a little bit above average. But with the showers in the southwest and the gusty winds here, it'll probably feel a little cooler and still that cold air in place across the far north. But for many, we'll get to double figures. 10, 11, 12, perhaps even 13 in one or two spots. During Saturday evening, not a great deal of change. We'll see a few more of these showers moving in. You can see the low pressure circulation here and that weather front still lingering across the extreme north of Scotland through the Northern Isles in particular, where it's still quite wet and windy even into uh, Saturday night. So still low pressure in control during Sunday, but it it has pushed that colder air further and further north, so pretty much all parts of the UK in that milder air by the time we get to Sunday. It is still February, however, so it's still going to feel pretty chilly when the showers come along. And with low pressure dominating, there is always the likelihood of some showers during Sunday. Uh, the rain perhaps clearing away from Shetland and then bands of showers drifting in from the west. The potential for a bit more wet weather to come back into parts of the east. Uh, but I think it'll be a murky old start over eastern areas. Mist, low clouds and fog around on Sunday. That could take quite a while to clear away as well. And a few more showers developing through the day across parts of Wales. Western England and Western Scotland. It is a messy old weekend then. Temperatures on Sunday again, high single figures, maybe double digits across parts of the south. So perhaps turning a little cooler as we go through the course of the weekend. Do keep up to date with the latest. You can see that Met Office weather warning for yourself on our app and our website. And the best way to stay up to date through the weekend is to hit subscribe to our YouTube channel.